Hello, everybody. I'm Shannon Baker. I'm a digital reporter with WNCT, and today I'm speaking with Morgan Gilbert about the Atlantic Beach Beach Music Festival. How are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm doing great. So tell me just a little bit about the festival and what's going on this week and this weekend. Sure. So this weekend is going to be the ninth annual Beach Music Festival here in Atlantic Beach. The festival kicks off at 11 a.m. on Saturday and has five bands that play until 6 p.m. And we have an event every night this week leading up to the festival to get everyone excited for beach music. What kind of entertainment can people expect? Who's going to be there? So the day of the festival, let me get the names correct because I don't want to say them out of order. So we're going to be starting with Gary Louder and the Smoking Hot Band. Then we'll have the Band of Oz. Third is going to be Jim Quick and the Coastline Band. Fourth is the I-42 Band. And last, we're going to close with the Mighty Saints of Soul. How many people are you expecting and how many people have been there in previous years? I know I've, I've been before and mm -hmm. it was packed, so I'm sure it'll probably be the same this year. Yeah, so it's really weather dependent. So if we have a beautiful day, we usually have around 5,000 people. Right now, it is supposed to be 76 degrees and sunny, so we're hoping for a really large crowd. Perfect. Other vendors or food trucks, maybe? Sure. So we're having four different food trucks there. We do three food trucks that are serving lunch, and we do one food truck that serves like a dessert. This year, it's going to be Sunset Slush of Atlantic Beach. Um, the food trucks are going to be, we have a Puerto Rican food truck coming. We have Dank Burrito coming. And then the Newport Vikings football team is doing a barbecue fundraiser, so they'll be serving food there as well. How about any parking information that people should know before they head out and are able to get there pretty easily? Sure. So parking can be an issue. So to help with that, we have free shuttle service available. Um, our free parking lots are going to be at the Carteret Community College, at the Atlantic Beach Town Park, and then there's also parking available at the Doubletree, but there is a fee to park. Um, but once you're parked, the shuttle service is free. Shuttles are running from 930 in the morning until 630 at night, and they'll take you to and from the circle. Um, there's also parking available at the circle, but it's $4 an hour, so people would need to plan ahead for that. All right. Is there anything else you'd like to add? Yeah. So like I mentioned, we do have Beach Music Week this week. Um, tonight is a DJ at the Tackle Box Tavern. Tomorrow night is a DJ at the Tipsy Turtle Tavern. Wednesday night, we are hosting Business After Hours with the Carteret County Chamber of Commerce, and it's going to be held at the Cottage, and that's going to feature live music from the Embers. Thursday night is going to be our fourth annual Beach Music Festival pub crawl. Um, Atlantic Beach isn't exactly walkable, so we provide shuttle service to 11 different Atl Atlantic Beach locations. Tickets are $10, and they'll be for sale online through Thursday. And then Friday night before the festival, we do a reception just for our sponsors. All right. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us, and I hope that you have a great turnout this weekend. Awesome. Thank you so much for featuring it.